quick break, okay? I want to, oh, this is going to be a new clip. Okay. Okay. The senators, the Senate races are getting really, really hot right now. The two main ones that are going to decide who has control of the Senate are going to be Ohio and Montana. This is Sherrod Brown and John Tester, both Democratic incumbents. Whoever wins these two Senate seats will control the Senate. In Ohio, it will most likely be Sherrod Brown versus Bernie Moreno. In Montana, it will most likely be John Tester versus um, uh, something Sheehy. Now, Sheehy Tim is Sheehy, Ted right? Sheehy, something like that. Tim. Tim. Tim Sheehy. I think it's Tim Sheehy. Tim Sheehy is the, yeah. okay, he is the establishment pick, the McConnell perfect golden boy to go and take out John Tester, okay? He is in a tight, um, somewhat tight primary race against Matt, against Matt Rosendale. Now, I want to bring your attention to these two races because if you're a Democrat and you are a little bit more of the moderate type, Sherrod Brown and John Tester are fantastic candidates for your line of thinking. Sherrod yeah. Brown is a true union guy. He does not focus much on like the racial or gender issues. Not saying he's bad on those issues from a left-wing perspective. He most certainly isn't, but that's just not what he does. That's not his bread and butter. He's big on banking regulation. He's a big supporter of the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau. He's massively supportive of unions. Mm -hmm. He's massively, uh, he's been working with J.D. Vance, who is the other senator from Ohio, on a train um, safety bill um, in response to the East Palestine train disaster last year. He's been working hard on stuff like that. So that's his game, okay? Now, in Montana, we have John Tester. John Tester has been a very strong bulwark um, for liberal policies, but also for keeping the Biden administration in check on some other things that are important to conservative mindsets. John Tester um, rejected the Biden administration's push for vaccine requirements. John Tester did not vote for vaccine requirements um, coming down from the federal government. He's done other things that coincide with a more conservative mindset, and he is truly a good liberal alternative to far-right craziness coming out of Montana. And so if you're interested in keeping the Senate majority in Democrat control, consider donating to John Tester and Sherrod Brown, Ohio, Montana. Great ad.